one of the features that's available with Gaggle and the Digital Locker is the ability to share files from your Digital Locker with others. So let's go and take a look at that in this video. Now here in this folder I have a file called Attendance List and Agenda. What I'm going to do is I'm going to share this file with another account that I have on Gaggle so you can see uh, what that looks like. With this file if I go over to the column which shows sharing I'm going to come here and I'm going to click on the not shared link. When I click on that, that's going to pop up an email dialog box. Now in this email dialog box, it's a very simple email dialog box, not much, uh, not very fancy. What I can do is I, in the to field I can enter the address of the recipient that I want to share this document with. So I'm going to go ahead and type in the email address of my other account. Now I'm sharing this with my other account and it automatically in the subject field indicates the file name of the file that I'm sharing with the other person and down here by default it has the option to allow the other person to be able to edit this document. So I'm going to leave it there. The other option is to view and I'm going to uh, share another document that allows only view access so that you can see what that does down here in the uh, content box if I wanted to I can include additional information about the file so I'm going to include something please fill in all the information once I've done that I'll come down here at the bottom and I will click invite and send it'll take a f couple of seconds and then the dialog box will disappear and I will be taken back to my digital locker and in my digital locker you will see here that this file now is changed to uh, uh, indicate that it's being shared now by me to one collaborator. Let's go ahead and share another document. I'm going to get this document right here. I'm going to share it again with my account but this time I'm going to have it uh, given only view rights. So in the to field I'm going to enter my email address now you can type as many email addresses as you want. I'm just typing one email here, but you can share this document with as many people as you like from your address book. Uh, there's no limit. I'm going to allow them to be only. So, and my message will be please read this carefully. And I'm going to click invite and send. Now that the dialog box is closed, I can see that the first file indicates that it's being shared by me with one collaborator, and the other file is being shared by me to one viewer. So collaborator means that the person can edit this file, and view means that the person can only look at the file but can't change anything. So in the next video, we're going to go ahead and take a look and see what that looks like from the other end.